Hey everybody, we're here with Epic Lloyd, otherwise known as Lloyd Alquist. He's got a brand new show called Epic Studios. You might seem familiar to you. Well, you do a little show, uh, Epic Rap Epic, Battles of History. Uh, what's the name of that show? Epic Rap Battles of History. Yes, yeah, that's like the that. one. So why don't you tell us a little bit about this new show. From what I, I saw, it's about a guy whose name is also Lloyd. You know, it's a stretch. The character is a stretch, but yes, his name is Lloyd. Mm -hmm. and he inherits a debunked recording studio from his rock star, drug addicted father. And when his father gets eaten by a lion, uh, it's up in Toronto, so he inherits that. And then he uh, just has to try to keep it afloat uh, so that he doesn't lose the whole place. Now you've, you've released about four episodes already, mm -hmm. and you're gonna be releasing on what kind of schedule? We released four today, mm -hmm. and then every Wednesday for the next four weeks, we're gonna release three until we get to 13. So 13 episodes all together. So I was lucky enough to watch a couple of the episodes, and I was wondering if we're gonna see a lot more animal maulings towards the end of the show, or is that just the beginning of the show? Well, I can't tell you that. It's, it's a, a spoiler secret. warning. It's, it's a like spoiler. That, so. There's lots of death. That's good. There's some death. There's, there's, lots. there's a few deaths. I mean, you gotta kill somebody, you know, or else it's not fun enough to watch. So how long was this idea rattling around in your head? I mean, this is a scripted show, about seven or eight minutes an episode, a little bit longer than some of the stuff you've been doing. Mm -hmm. Where did this come about? I have two very dear friends of mine, Aaron Krebs and Joe Goslicki is his wife, and they've been friends with me forever, and they saw the success of rap battles and, and some of the music that I do, and we work together on, I own a comedy club in Santa Monica, mm -hmm. California, Westside Comedy. So they were like, what if we tried to come up with an idea that was more like a, TV show or a story show. So they pitched me this idea. I was like, yeah, it's great. I love that. We went up to Montreal to the Just for Laughs comedy festival there and pitched in a pitch contest. And then we got the attention of some Canadian producers. And then that last May, we shot it up in Toronto for six weeks. And then we just released it this week. So it's been a long process of creation, but it's been a joy. And one of the, the main antagonists is Kevin McDonald, or played by Kevin McDonald, yeah. from Kids in the Hall. When yes, I saw sir. that, I'm like, ah, <laughs> I know. this is awesome. I know. What was that like working with him? Well, he crushed my head several times. <laughs> uh, He's just he, going around doing that? Yeah, just everywhere. He was great. He was like super professional and super excited to be there. And he's one of those guys where you just turn the camera on and you're like, yeah, that was funny. Yeah, that was good. Yeah, that was fine. You want to just do that again? Great. So we, we have to talk about rap battles. Mm -hmm. We've been doing that for a very long time. Mm -hmm. Now, I wanted to ask you, do you have any favorites that you tried to make work that you just you just had to get rid of it, you had to reject it? What's your favorite rejected rap battle? We did Henry VIII versus Hillary Clinton once, and it just didn't make it in terms of, it was our fault, it wasn't anybody else's. We just couldn't, we didn't shoot it right, and all the pieces didn't come together right, so we couldn't just, we just couldn't get the quality where it needed to be, so that's like one that never made it off the shelf. So that would be what I would say. And I gotta ask the selection process, because I was watching was uh, Ash Ketchum versus Darwin, uh -huh. Charles Darwin, and I'm like, do you have like two giant wheels, and you're like, are you throwing darts? What are you, how are you picking it's the, these? the audience. It's always at the end of every video, who's who won, who's next. So the audience submits all the suggestions of what they wanna pick, it, that's you guys. Then we just go through and see which ones resonate with us and which ones are liked the most and which ones everybody in the world wants to see. And then if there's like some character that like the election, for example, is obviously something we're gonna do. Or we, we did Deadpool right around the time of the Deadpool movie. He's been a popular character for a while. The timing made sense. So we, we kind of look at it from a, a strategic and also popularity. That was Deadpool standpoint. versus Boba Fett, right? Yeah. That one was killing me. I was watching that. It was yeah. hilarious. Yeah. Okay, so would you mind doing a freestyle? Yeah. No. But uh, let's find a choice for you. So inside this helmet, okay. we've got some Game Boy games. Okay. So if you pick one of the games, maybe that's your topic, or pick two of the games, whatever you want. All right, I'll just, we got a mic over here. We I'll just, I'll just pull them out as I go. How about that? Sounds like a plan. Brian, you can drop that beat, dog. Oh yeah. That's a sweet beat. Here we gonna go. Yo, it's Epic Lloyd at CNET. They said, do a freestyle. I said, you bet. So I'm gonna go over to this helmet and rap about some of these things in it. Huh. I've been rapping since our Arsenio days, so let me spit a little bit about these video games. Yo, this one's Yoshi. <laughs> I used to be with that bear named Yogi. Yogi Bear with the sandwiches. Yo, I got mad handwiches. This one I think is from a Game Boy. That was a very expensive toy, so I never really got one. I just got grounded. And but these video games got thumb pounded, cause it was just the A and the B. And I beat the freestyle MC. E P I C double L O Y D. Got no hair, and I rap about these games sitting on this chair. Let me do one more. This is Pokemon. Yeah, Pokemon. 
Pokemon, this is straight up the bomb, yo. My mom never played no Pokemon, but my brother and my dad, they were like, yo, come on. We all sat down and we played all day, and now I do these things in these words that I spray. One more game. Yo, I think this one is called Bonks. This one's called Bonks. Man, I ain't got no bonks. What even rhymes with bonks? Like tonks, half a tonks. A tonk is a truck, a tonk a truck. Yo, a bonk a truck. I don't know. I gotta keep going and spit off the top. This guy's got a meat bone in his hand. And that little dude, he is my man. He looks like a little caveman with the fur and feet. He's not a type of dude I want to meet, but I put this in and I play for about an hour. I got all kind of points and lots of power. Ups, I don't give no f Yo, I wanna go through when I get some trucks. So here's my last game. This one is Mario Baseball. I wanna get all up in your face, y'all. And I hit the single, maybe double. If you get the third, then you're gonna be in trouble. Oh, this rap's been fun. But like this Mario game, I gotta hit a home one. I do my thing, I never turn and scoff. I'm Epic Lloyd and it's time to walk off.